Okay. So today we are discussing an American Girl doll, which is a toy targeted for young girls throughout America, but specifically Addie Walker, um, which is the first um, black American Girl doll. So I want to begin by giving a little bit of background on American Girl dolls. Um, so these are dolls um, for children, mostly targeted girls um, ages 6 through 10. And then there's about 50 different dolls, one being released each year. And then when purchasing these dolls, you do um, get some background and then a story that comes with her. So um, as children grow and learn more about themselves, they often look for role models or characters to represent them. Um, this may be similarities growing up or even um, similarities in appearance. But for the most part, um, these dolls can be just that for these girls. So young girls can see a part of themselves in these dolls. and that in itself um, helps them develop. So let's talk about Addie. This is Addie Walker. She was released as a doll in 1993 and her story consists of her living on a southern plantation in the 1800s. Um, so being a victim of slavery, her and her mother escape to Philadelphia but have to leave their family behind. So on the surface level, the story is supposed to demonstrate Addie's courage and strength in a difficult time. Um, but this, again, is not based on a true story, um, rather created for her character. Um, so here are some points to consider. Um, the doll itself is the first black doll that is created to represent, represent black America in a positive light. Um, so prior to this, many of, the to many of the toys that were created had exaggerated facial features and aspects to the doll that were just completely inappropriate and offensive. And um, this doll was kind of a start for um, positive representation. So this doll does not have any caricature-like features or any stereotypes. And um, it was definitely a step in the right direction as far as toys go. Another positive about this doll is that when young girls do play with the doll, they um, listen to the story about her past. And they, they are learning um, a little bit of history about slavery. Um, but one of the major criticisms is that many young girls in the black community are not really represented with Addie. So um, white children had many representations to choose from. Um, but black children seem to really only have one, which was a runaway slave. And while Addie's char characteristics were inspiring, the story could have been created in a way that focused on a young black girl that became educated and successful, but instead it was created focusing on slavery. So this doll isn't inherently bad, but it doesn't necessarily capture the youth of the black community today. So while creating a black American Girl doll may have been a step toward progress, the doll itself is really not appropriately representative of its audience. Young black girls should have a representation that encourages bravery and strength, characteristics of Addie, but not in the name of slavery.